Good morning and welcome back on day 8 on our journey to 2000. And let's play some chess. 50 minutes, 10 seconds increments. Here we go and let's see who we are playing today. Marvelous, we have the white pieces against uh, Des, Des On von Gott. Tess Vater. <laughs> okay. Um, you go for this uh, this thing from Germany. Marvelous. <clears throat> All right. So he goes with the bishop out. All right. We go for castles. And then we will see. There we go. Now the question is, do we play d4, c4? Or do we play c4 right away? Uh, and what if they push by? That's, that is the question. Now what if we do both? Hmm. I know this is probably what I should be doing, right? Uh, this is probably what we should be doing. I don't know. We are experimenting a little bit. And after the game, we will check the course to see if we implemented the right idea. Now, I created a poll. Um, so um, if you want to check that out, the poll is about the content I make on Sundays or uh, days I'm feeling off. Um, so I really would love your input uh, on that. Um, so I think you can find the poll on the community page, but I'm not 100% sure. So we can give a check and win back the poll like that. And I think that's what I'm going to do. So check and then take. And yeah, he can play that, gaining some tempo. But that weakens that pawn quite massively. Um, so let's see. This would also be a nice move. I think. Um. Even this to take that bishop out. Now I could start with this one. Um, because if I go here and he goes there. Ooh. Well, maybe I can go here and here. Let's try that. Let's try to grab that bishop. Opens up my bishop here. And on that move, I can go here and here because there are some alignment issues. You always can play here, but 
and it's it's just uh, tricky. That is tricky. And I need to develop my other pieces. So my knight needs to find, needs to get out my bishop. I probably end up playing this, I think. So he does goes there. So I want to go here. Um, oh, but now, now he's, he's targeting. No, he's not. Yes, he's targeting that pawn. Maybe d4. Mm, I'm not sure. This we can play that. Um, we could also go here, here. Ah, so here, here. What do I do on that move? Well, I guess I can take... Let's go here. This was protected now by two pieces. So now I can play here and here. That's the plan. can play h6 to prevent my bishop from coming there. That's an option. So he castles. Let's play here. It also pre prevents the knight from coming in. Here I still have this tactic. No, I don't. Uh, because pawn takes and then my queen is hanging. So that's not probably what I want. Um, I almost have some interesting tactics. Now, what if I play here um, to get rid of the knight? That is abandoning the pawn. So we could potentially win the pawn there. Uh, so probably that's not what I want. I think I can win a pawn here. If I play here, I'm forcing him to go here. I can play here. Here, then I can take, take, check. Hmm, that could be, that could be interesting. That could be interesting. Um, But it's weakening and do I want to play a weakening move? I can also just protect the pawn with the rook. And what do I do on that move? Do 
Do I go here? It's slow. What happens if I if I just take? That's not good enough. Um, I think I'm going here. I think I'm going to protect the pawn. Yes, that is a move. And I think I'm, I'm, oops, I think I want to go here then. I'm, I'm running low on squares, so I need to be a little bit careful. So he develops the knight. <clears throat> Reinforcing that knight. It's probably a good move, but it's... Now that knight is loosey doosey Or the bishop is loosey doosey So now I'm thinking again about this move. Here, 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 here. Takes, takes, check, and then I'm winning the bishop. Uh, it doesn't have to go like that. He has also this move uh, and this move. But I want to go for this. I want to go for this plan. Now, if he goes there, <clears throat> yeah, then this thing is not going to happen. Then I have to change up my strategy a little bit. Perhaps I'm go and then I'm sliding back, getting my queen out of all the shenanigans. I mean, this is also a move. Yeah, so he goes there. I think that's a good move. Um, I can be stubborn and stay here, but uh, I don't want to be stubborn. Uh, let's go here. Let's get the king to safety, or the, the queen to safety. Unfortunately, this plan is not going to work. I can still go for it, of course. If I want to. Um, but I probably won't. That was a good move. Yeah, 
now he needs to make a decision i think i think this is the move he wants to make and i'm not sure if i want to play here it does win a pawn takes takes check but i'm not convinced that that is the way to go but maybe it is i don't know here 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 there you go somewhere then I have to deal with the open file. Um, yeah, so I'm not sure. I'm not sure if I'm going to do that. I'm not sure. I like this approach a lot more. Just to get rid of the knight here. Maybe it goes back again. Then the tactic is working. He's defending. He's playing good. He's finding good moves. I have to give him that. Wow. But now his rook is not defending this anymore. Hmm. He's putting pressure here. Okay, let's get right. I would assume that the knight goes back and I can push more. Just to soften up a little bit here. <clears throat> Okay, so he goes to the center. Again, a good move. Now, if I take, he probably will take with this pawn. So I'm not really into that. Alright, so I can push by. <clears throat> Just creating some inconvenience, but uh, that's about it. So he does take. That's interesting. Now I can infiltrate with my rook. Uh, and I will. I think I will. I can also first take the knight. Uh. 
Bank. Let's infiltrate. And I'm also attacking this pawn. I think my opponent wants to play that. I think I'm going back then. And we need to develop that bishop somewhere. Maybe even dropping the knight back at some point. If he takes... I probably take with the pawn. Just to fix the structure a little bit. So, yeah, so we go here. Oh, that's a good move. Yeah, I missed that move. Oh, that's a good, good move. Yeah, I completely missed that. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So we are down the exchange. But it's not the end of the world. We still have uh, chances that pawn thing so it's not over Wow, that's a strong, a strong 900 here, guys. Wow. And yeah, now he's going for a queen trade. He's up material, so he wants to trade. And he's putting pressure here on my, uh, on my pawn. Mm. So yeah, there you go. Well, I have a feeling this is not a game we are going to win. But we can at least try to make a couple of good moves. For instance, I could play here. Now, what if he takes and I go here? Then this whole idea is, uh, oh wow, a sacrifice. Ah, I can take because of the pin. Oh, that's so nasty. That's so nasty. <laughs> oh, it's really nasty. Wow. This is really not looking good. Yeah, this is not looking good. Wow. Yeah, this is close to uh, GG's. Now, takes, takes, does he has a checkmate? Um, 
Okay, no, uh, no, I have a bishop there, right? so I, I could, I could play that. Maybe. Hmm. Just checking his account. It's just uh, he's so strong. Yeah, or we are not playing good. Maybe a combination of both. Yeah, you know that's the thing about n learning new openings. Um, it's just. being so unfamiliar with the positions what probably there's a sick tactic here I'm missing takes it's probably going to win all my material here That's such a weird decision. Hmm. I don't get it. Um. I don't get it. Why sacrificing the queen there? Such a weird move. But he has the bishop pair and the two rooks. Oh, I'm dropping the knights. Yeah, it's it's just we we are not playing well. Wow, he misses the hanging knight here. That's interesting. Now do we take with the bishop or with the queen? takes and the knight is still loose I can do this now let's uh, let's take with uh, let's not lose more material yes this pawn is, is hanging Alright, um, so he does goes for the pawn, good, so how do we do this, how do we do this? Yeah. 
yeah, that port is also lost. Um, and we need to do something about the knights. Maybe bring the knight back. And yeah. I'm not talking that much now. I'm full focus here. I'm trying to. Okay. Now I like the idea of centralizing. Uh, I don't like the idea of the rook coming in. I also like the idea of going here and but then he takes here maybe I get pinned. I have to try something, right? On the pin I take here. I'm about to be in checkmate, by the way. Not right now, because I will take. Although, no, that's 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 checkmate. I I guess I have the bishop, eh? I still have the bishop. you retreats probably a good move um, yes deal with checkmates I don't, I don't see a lot of good moves I mean takes here I don't know um, here check If I lead with the knight, okay. I don't know. We only have a minute. I guess after check, I can block with the bishop. Oh, the bishop is defending the rook, so that's good to know. I 
This would also be a nasty move. Um, because... Well, I probably will go there then. Because right now I have to check here. This is not possible because my knight covers. So if he deflects my knight, I go here for instance, and he has check here that he can just go here. Ooh. Ooh. That is so nasty. Okay. Okay, there's the pawn. Do we have a sacrifice? Takes, takes, check, maybe perpetual. to try something right I guess he just can go here absolutely destroy me with the bishops I'm completely lost here yeah that's amazing amazing wow good game good game let's go to the analysis Oof. wow he played with a 90.9 uh, we played with a 77. Now we didn't play it well. Um, we didn't play well. Hmm. Hmm. Feels a little bit fishy this game, but uh, uh, oh, just one second. All right, I'm back. Needed to blow off some steam uh, after a game like this. Um, so uh, our opponent played with a 90.9 .9 and we played with 77 um, and i'm just going to say it out loud this game gave me some bad vibes um, i'm not going to say he cheated i think he played a good game but there were a couple of moments mm, i don't know we, we are going to look at it um, but we also have to admit that we didn't play it fantastic let's be honest so this was all fine and I looked it up in the course in the meantime uh, and I remember that a couple of days ago we went over this uh, so this is this type of structure in the Slav um, chapter um, and they said well they can do two things they can attack your knight with the bishop then you have to respond in a certain way or they play bishop f5 um yes so he castles uh, and we play c4 so that is the right uh, how do you say that the right uh, theme so there we go so they took and i went with the queen check um the computer likes it but the course recommends to grab that with the knight and if they try to hold on to the pawn you just uh, sacrifice the pawn now i remember it again um, you get a complete open board and that's very nice and an unca uncastled king so that would be a nice position now we we went with the queen so that's mistake number one i would say this would be probably better but they already played e uh, e6 eh? so they could also go for this um, ah but then we have yeah 
ja, 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 ja. This I, I, now it comes back alive to me. And we can just take like that. I think we do that. Yeah, take with the queen is fine. Or even with the pawn. So we can still win back this pawn being cat to the bishop. Maybe this this is even better. You can always use that pawn to uh, to just uh, disrupt uh, that pawn structure. So that was mistake number one. But further than that, I think we can find out the opening and well, just like uh, yesterday. Now it's plus zero point eight. So yeah, we did uh, we did fine. Um, so yeah, here I had the idea that if he went here, I thought I could go here and here and then maybe have this tactic winning a, winning a piece. That would be nice, but uh, he saw that, of course. Um, so he prevented that. Uh, so yeah, rook e8 is actually a slight inaccuracy. Funny. This was fine. A6. I don't think it's even that bad, but it likes d4 more. Why, do, why is the computer a huge fan of d4? These are the type of moves I don't understand. Is it to prevent uh, expansion? Yeah, Stockfish doesn't come with an explanation, eh? Uh, I choose d4 as the best move because of reason a, b, and c. Uh, d4... Yeah, I don't get d4. Yeah, and here I made a, a mistake. Yep, there was a nice find. He did, he did took a long time to think to take the rook. That was raising some flags inside me. It's like, okay, well, he's taking like 10 to 15 seconds to uh, come up with that move. Um, yeah. But anyway, um, that was a nice tactic. Yep. And here this move, sacrificing the queen for a bishop and a rook. I'm not gonna lie, I've never seen anyone, I think below 1800 in our previous journey, choosing to sacrifice the queen for a bishop and a rook. Here I missed this move. He didn't even took it. What did he do? Oh, he took on e4, which is the second engine move. It's crazy. Yeah. Ah, this is this is very clean. Nice technique. Yeah. All right. What do we take away from this game? Well, um, opening was good. This was all fine. And if they accept the gambit, then you try to regain it with the knight. Or with the queen. It's not even that bad. So you, we can choose. However we feel. Here that was good. Um, 
Yeah, honestly, I don't think that maybe D4 was 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 better. Maybe D4. Why didn't I I go for D4? What was my reasoning? Um, yeah, I think I didn't want to go there because of this move. I thought, well, it's just nice to have these squares controlled, but. I guess that the knight indeed can go here or here. So d4 makes sense, grab more space. Also kicking the bishop, just one square. Hmm, not sure what the difference is between bishop on g4 or h5. I like the bishop better on g4 to be honest. You never know if the knight ever moves. I'm trying to take something away from this game as a learning thing. Now this is just a bad move. I think we were doing fine at this moment, um, but we were just playing too fast. A4 is even better, but I never saw the fork, so. Yeah. Hmm. I think D4, I think D4 is what we take away from this game that more often than not we want to play d4 in the structures i think um, but i will check the course or uh, after the recording more in depth um, yeah, and tactics he outplayed me with the tactics and here i just hang a knight And yeah, I'm completely lost here. Knight f3. Knight f3. Yeah. I don't think, and th from this point, uh, it's, it's not worth analyzing uh, because I had no chance. So, opening okay. Spirit of the course is uh, regaining the pawn with the knight. So let's keep that in mind. Uh, further than that, d4. Play d4. That's what I'm taking away with it. Um, and I can. That that's from the easy course. We can check out what the difficult course is saying about this structure. All right. So this is the difficult book. Although for me, I, I will call the other one easy. This one difficult. It's a way to uh, to uh, to separate them for me and we have to go to the slav structure um i think it's this with bishop f5 but i played bishop f4 right but i think it's more of the same uh, right yeah it transposes oh this this one yeah and then we, okay, yeah, I like I like this actually better, but the move order, okay, so, but they took, yeah, this is an entirely different, uh, different section, uh, yeah, I'm following the easy, uh, easy course on this one for now, just because I don't like uh, the structures after uh, D4, so. Yeah, this is not very useful. Although, if they never take and leave the tension, we can transpose to something that looks like this. Yeah, we also looked at this. Yeah, expanding on the queen sides. Yep. And 
and they have a bunch of lines when they go bishop g4 what is this uh, different move orders looks the same um, okay so there we go that's about it I want to thank you for watching I'm going to end the video here uh, enjoy the rest of your day please like subscribe or leave a comment and don't forget about the poll uh, let me know uh, what kind of content uh, you would like in the future and um, yeah then we are going to uh, retry it uh, back uh, tomorrow all right goodbye